Okay, in this video we're going to go over the hunt. In the top right corner, just below the logo, you'll notice the hunt banner. This appears when the hunt is active, and we can click on this and access the hunt page. Real quick, the hunt items are located in Vegas, and that's a level 10 city. New players can't access, obviously, the level 10 city, so we normally will send out the items you need so you can participate in the hunt to get you started. Uh, if we happen to forget you or something, you can just shoot us an email or holler at us in chat, and we'll send you over the items so you can uh, play. In in Vegas, in the shops menu, you'll, you'll see Jeeves Hideout. This is where the items are located. Once we get in there. And we need the three items. We need a sword, armor, and shield. And the object of the hunt is to get the highest record kill, which is indicated here in the bottom center. And the highest kill possible is 9,999, and there's uh, top three places, and you get paid blood drops if you land in one of these three places. And then real quick, back on your home screen, just to go over the uh, final steps of the hunt, so you're aware, the hunt advertisement appears here at all times, and this will also take you into the hunt screen obviously when one is active but if it's not active it will display the stats showing the place of the last hunt so if you're in first place second place or third place you will get a notification telling you that you you placed in the hunt and will and will give out your prize in the inventory section here you'll see the three items our sword armor and shield and then in the info section here, you'll see just at the bottom, it says 21 minutes remaining. That's your timer for the hunt, letting us know that we have 21 minutes in the hunt that's active. Down in the bottom left corner, just indicates who has started the hunt. And then obviously in the center here is our record kill for this hunt. And then the hunt button. And basically, we just click the hunt button. And we keep clicking the hunt, bu hunt button and try to get the highest total possible. And then when, when you destroy or lose or break one of your items, you'll need to go back to the hunt screen. Just click the back button. And then for new players that are just starting out, all three of these items will indicate that you need to use this item and what that means is you just have to equip all three items and then when you break or lose something you have to re-equip it before you can continue on so we'll just go ahead and click this and re-equip our shield and then go back and then down here when you break or lose or destroy something in battle you have to wait five minutes to continue so here you just wait for your timer to expire and the hunt the hunt button to return. Apparently I can't say hunt today. Once the button returns then you can continue on. And that's a basic run through of the hunt.